Hello, Cougar Cubs. Welcome to Cubs Corner. Today, you will see a video from our school's counselor, Mr. Farrell. He will be showing everyone how music plays a huge part in the videos that we watch daily. I miss every single one of you. Stay safe and enjoy the video. What's up, Cougar Cubs? Here's a, a digital high five going out to you since we can't actually be together right now. Hopefully you're sending some digital high fives back my way, you know, as I've been sitting at home and uh, out of my normal routine and know that, you know, the same is true for you. I kind of got to thinking that, uh, you know, some of y'all might be experiencing some cabin fever and, and uh, getting kind of bored with things. And, and so I, I, I came up with some ideas to help you uh, spruce up your day a little bit and not be so bored and to fight off some of that uh, cabin fever that you might be experiencing. You know, the the first thing that I thought of is I was kind of sitting around, been binge watching a lot of different movies and TV shows with my wife or uh, sitting up at night when I got some extra free time. It's, it's the music that's playing uh, in, in the background of those different movies and TV shows. And, and I don't know if you've ever noticed the uh, the types of music that plays while you're watching a movie or a TV show, but if you're watching something that's supposed to be scary or spooky or uh, a thriller, you might have you might have noticed him playing some music, something like this. You know, if you were watching an action movie where people are driving fast cars and racing them off rooftops and dangling from cliffs and things like that, you might have heard something like this. That's because movie makers and TV show producers, they've known this fact for a long time, and, and that's that music will uh, shape and change the mood and the feelings that you're having. So when they want you to uh, experience what the people in the movie are experiencing, whether they're running from some something coming after them or driving a motorcycle off a rooftop, they'll pick some music that'll get you in that kind of mood, like something's coming to get you or something exciting's happening and you're ready to go and feel that great uh, big adre adrenaline rush. Well, you know, that same type of idea applies to your everyday life, whether you're watching a movie or whether you're washing dishes or whether you're uh, playing outside or sitting in your room, the music that's playing will certainly help uh, shape your mood and direct it. So... My first tip is to incorporate some music into your day. Pick some songs that, that you know will boost your spirits, something energetic and peppy and something that will put you in a happy mood. If you're sitting around worried and nervous, pick you some music that's calming and soothing. You can even go on YouTube and set you up a playlist and gather songs about how they affect you and make you feel and set them up in a playlist, exciting music, energetic music, calming music. Put those in a playlist and then listen to them. And for an, for an added boost, when you listen to that music, sing along, get up, dance, move around. Then not only you get the, the enjoyment of the listening to the music and how it makes your emotions feel, you'll feel even better from just being up and being moving around and being a little more active. I look forward to uh, when we finally make it back and we're together and it's not digital high fives and smiles that uh, you get to uh, share with me all the different fun and uh, new things that you tried during your free time, and and uh, and we'll swap some stories. Until then, here's a digital high five for the road. Y'all have a good uh, a good time trying all the things, and enjoy your time till we're together again.